This is the view from inside Hurricane Idalia, and it's a view that we really can't get in person because the storm is just so dangerous. But as a hurricane, uh, we send, or at least NOAA, in partnership with Sail Drone, sends an unmanned craft into these hurricanes. Been doing it for a few years now, and it is amazing just to see how big the seas are. Here to talk about that is Greg Foltz. He's a NOAA oceanographer and also the NOAA science lead for the Sail Drone project. So, Greg, thanks so much for your time today. Yeah, thank you. Good to be here. Let's talk about that partnership. I know it's kind of newer between Sail Drone and NOAA, if you can explain. All right. Yeah, so it's been going on about 10 years now, and it's been a really successful partnership. Uh, we've done a lot of amazing, exciting things with Sail Drones, and this is kind of the, uh, the most extreme project that we have going, uh, trying to send Sail Drones into hurricanes. Um, and it's worked really well. Sail Drone's been a really good partner. Um, and so basically we do the science and they set up everything else. They take care of the data transmission and deploying the Sail Drones. And we focus on seeing where we want the Sail Drones to go and then doing the analysis uh, and sending the data to forecast centers. So in the past several years, have you already seen any you know, fruits of the labor of this? Any positives that have come out from you know, having this data and also the imagery? Uh, yeah, so the data goes into forecast centers in real time. So that's that's a big advantage that they can uh, improve the model forecasts of hurricane intensity, especially uh, around the world. Um, and the research, we're seeing some really interesting things in terms of the research in the cores of hurricanes that the cell drones have gotten into. So we're seeing like how the uh, momentum exchange happens and how it depends on waves and sea spray and how strong the winds are. Um, so that, that's called the drag effect uh, of how the ocean can slow down a hurricane's winds and potentially weaken it. So, uh, yeah, really exciting stuff coming out so far. What impresses you most about, you know, hurricanes and that natural phenomena? Uh, yeah, I mean, the uh, honest, I mean, the rapid intensification uh, is just really intriguing to me. It's really challenging to predict. Uh, and, and it can have such a big impact, such a um, devastating impact if it happens before landfall. And we've seen that happen in the past few years, uh, a few times. So it's really important to understand and we don't know a lot about it. And um, so we need measurements like this and all the other data we're getting from other observing assets to be able to understand this better and hopefully uh, predict it better and help uh, save lives, protect property. Okay, Greg Foltz, oceanographer, and uh, kind of the NOAA lead here for the science project there with Sail Drone. Thanks so much. All right, thank you. My pleasure.